Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Kyle Let's Keep and today we are gonna talk about how an Indian can become a K-pop idol in Korea. So it's 2020 and there are lots of new rules that have been implemented on becoming a K-pop idol. So before the competition was a little bit easier but now it's a little bit tougher. So before you become a K-pop idol in Korea, you need to become a successful K-pop trainee. So in order to become a trainee, you need to be good at dancing, singing or rapping. So you need to audition, you need to go for any kind of audition like let's say private audition or public audition. So mostly people go for uh, public audition but private auditions are those where you are being trusted uh, by uh, staff from the entertainment company and they will call you. Uh, to just prepare a audition so they will just uh, check your audition skills I mean your singing dancing rapping skills your looks as well but the most important thing I want to tell you is that as you already know that uh, in order to pass a audition you need to be good at singing dancing or rapping so there are two more important thing that most people never told you till today and I'm here to tell you about these two important things. So the first important thing is your confidence. So let's say that even though you are not good at dancing, singing or rapping, but if you are very confident in front of the judges, you will definitely pass. And I'm sure that uh, most judges, I mean every single judge who uh, sits on the audition uh, room, they mostly look for confidence uh, of a trainee who wants to become a K-pop idol. So confidence matters a lot. It's the most important thing because they can only teach you singing, dancing, rapping or modeling or acting. But they can't build your confidence. It's uh, such a thing that you need to build on your own. So if you already have confidence, good luck you are half the way i mean let's say you are 70 percent done to pass the audition and only 30 percent required so we will talk about the 30 percent so the next important thing is fashion as you already know that uh, south korea is a very highly developed country and people all over the country are fashionable and especially teenagers are very highly fashionable because they are being inspired by their favorite K-pop idols, artists like uh, IU, then Bobby from Icon, then Jigok, then Jepar. Uh, they are the inspires and they are the role models for the teenagers. I mean, you must have uh, already noticed that no one ever tells you about uh, being fashionable because uh, when you go for an audition, the judge will look at your dress up. So if you uh, dress up as fresh as you can, then they will definitely gonna choose you. So for this, you need to focus on your dress or how you dress. Uh, if you think that uh, you are not good enough in your dressings, then you need to improve on your dress. So for that, uh, just uh, go and look at your favorite K-pop idols, just look at their dress ups, dressing styles and just try to follow them with your own. Uh, if you can match it up, that's very good. So they are idols are very fashionable and that's what makes them attractive. And if, that, if, and if it makes them attractive, it can make you confident. If you dress up well, you will be very confident and it's a psychological trick that no one tells and when you dress up well uh, you feel confident it boosts your confidence and when it boosts your confidence you will be able to do better at the audition so these are the two most important things and another important thing uh, in your singing dancing or rapping skills is that you need to if you are struggling to become a good singer or a good dancer or a good rapper then don't worry hire a private copy you might need to spend a little bit of your money but it's worth the investment because uh, when you hire a private coach they will teach you the proper way to sing dance or rap so in singing i will just short it out that you need to focus on your vocal cords 
so mostly they will uh, give you vocal exercise let's say that if you are of age 16 or 17 then just take a year prepare well and after a year uh, you can go for any kind of audition that you want in any entertainment company in korea whether it's a uh, walking audition or a uh, online audition it doesn't matter so here we come with the dancing skill i have seen a lot of people used to struggle to become a good dancer so just go and hire a private coach or join a dance studio where you will be taught with good dancing skills with the very basic skills they will teach you every basic skills in order to become a dancer so in order to become a dancer the very first basic thing is to have a very good body flow so the better your body flow the better you become a dancer so that's the most important thing people don't realize but i'm telling you so these are the most important thing and for rapping you can also hire a private code only if you are really interested in rap so that's the important thing and apart from then if you focus on dancing then try to make your own choreograph mostly focus on uh, dancing to freestyle music uh, try to do freestyles as much as possible don't rely on choreographs on choreography videos because when you go for audition the judge will play any kind of random kind of music and you will have to dance on it on your dancing skills so that's how an artist is defined even goes for the singing so they might ask you some the very basic questions on singing mostly on high note or low note so just prepare for it and after that just go for audition and have fun don't be nervous don't feel any kind of anxiety so if you are very confident you will never feel nervous at all uh, you will mostly feel like you are having fun in front of the judge you are having fun in singing dancing or rapping so these are the most important thing in order to become a trainee before you become a K-pop idol. So if you become a successful K-pop idol, if you land up in an entertainment company like SMYG or JYP, then you are ready to uh, reach your next step. You are very close to your dream. So that's what I really tell. Okay guys, that's all for today. I really hope you enjoyed the video. Do give a thumbs up to my video and also share the video with your friends. And if you are a new visitor to my channel, then do subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell and I will see you on my next video. Till then, take care. Bye.